Let's talk about some of the basic receive functions that you'll want to know about. Obviously, there's the audio free or the uh, audio frequency gain. That would be alpha alpha four. And turn that up and down as necessary. The outer ring on this particular knob is your RF gain. If you turn it to the left, it reduces your RF gain, which is going to be used sometimes to uh, reduce uh, uh, interference from stations off to the side. You bring it back up. If you turn it the other way, it actually becomes a squelch control. So if you're operating under uh, net conditions and you only want to hear it when somebody's actually talking, you can bring up your squelch. We're going to leave it pretty much the way it is. Right now we've got a pretty strong signal here about F5, S5. If I hit the preamp button, you'll hear the difference in the strength of the signal come up. There's, and there's two preamp settings, off, one, and two. Here's off. One, two. Now, if you've got a really strong signal and you want to attenuate it, if you hold down on this button, you'll see the ATT come on, and that attenuates a strong signal, which in some cases, if you've got a strong signal that you're, that you're actually talking to, you turn on the attenuation, you're going to reduce the interference coming in from the side. So you can use the attenuation and the RF gain together if you wanted. There's a number of other functions that we'll want to use here. I'm going to turn off of this channel or this frequency so we don't have him to listen to. We have noise reduction and noise reduction allows you, you push if you push the NR button, the noise reduction button, you'll see NR come up here and then you can use the inner knob here and you can dial in the amount of noise reduction that you want. You can hear it getting very quiet. And if I turn it down, you hear the background noise come back up. So if you've got a really noisy band or a lot of local electrical noise or something like that, you can adjust this control to try to knock that out. You can hear the background noise go away. Now the notch button, let's turn the noise reduction off here. The notch filter, there's two settings. If I press it once, you'll notice it says A notch. And that's an automatic notch capability. If you have a heterodyne of some sort on the frequency and you want to eliminate it, uh, you can press the A notch button and that will follow one frequency and uh, try to eliminate it from your signal.